This is code.org. Ooh, and we have a check for understanding. So let's take a look at these. Override, scope, return type, and overloading. All right. Where a variable can be used to define a method in a subclass with the same method signature as method inherited. The type of value to be given from a method defining two or more constructors or methods. All right. I want to point out, let's use our resources. So we can kind of debate some of these, right? Like return type. Well, type, it must be something to do with data. And we can kind of scan over here. Well, which one of these also says the word type? Oh, but let's, we're better than that. Watch. Codador gives us a bazillion resources. So I just clicked up there. What am I on? I'm on 10 right now. Bam. Lesson resources. Let's check this out. Let's see. Okay, we have this keyword and we have scope. Oh, look, scope. All right, where a variable can be used. And what's that saying, guys? Within a method, if you have a variable, you can use it only within that method. Now, if you have a variable at the top of your class, that variable could be used out the thing, used throughout the thing. But it matters if if you declare a variable inside of a method, you can't just use it everywhere. It's local. So scope, where a variable can be used. Okay, so we still have a few of these and we still have a bunch of resources. Back here, let me check out nine. Let's see at the vocab on this, do a little review. Escape, ooh, override. To define a method in a subclass with the same method signature as a method inherited from the superclass. Yeah, so if the class above it has the exact same method, we can define a new method and the method in the subclass will be used. That's what we just did with cookie and uh, cake and technically with dessert as well. We're overriding the default class within Java. So to define a method in a subclass with the same method signature, right? With the same name and stuff is what a method signature is. It's a fancy way of saying that. So, oop, that would be an override. All right. Let's go up. Mutator. Nope. None of those I didn't see. Accessor. Return by value. Return type. What did we have? Return type. Perfect. Return type. The type of a value to be given from a method. And now, through process of, of elimination, defining two or more constructors or methods with the same name, but different signatures so different signatures maybe one has two parameters or something like this cool overloading right because you can add stuff to it you're loading it up or overriding would be identical all right make sure to use your resources on work